<laughs> just, just stop. How good is that? Beauty. Oh, that's amazing. Neat. First off, praise to the most high. Glorious you and you are the ruler, it's in you to my hope lies. Oh God, no lie, no buy, I don't play both sides. Been so down with the windows down, truth music blowing at the whip, so loud you repent when I roll by. Hey, hey. So we got Luke Fink's AU in for the AU house treatment. Oh, it's, I, I punched it. It's auto weight reduction. Yeah, I punched it and a hole came in. So I was like, sick. All right, so we got Luke's AU on the hoist. We're gonna do a check underneath this car and see if it's even worth doing this car. So, full do. Oh, crap, it's locked up. Where's the light? So first of all, we have his perfectly good steerers right here. See, the trick is when you enter, you use actually this side of the tire. So this actually does not matter. So you don't have to worry about that. Same as this. This side won't really matter when you're entering the main turns. So this is the important part. Perfectly calculated. Oh, she's not too bad actually. Bit of power sweat. A little bit more power sweat from the old trains. It looks like someone's had their trains out before because they haven't put the clip on properly. Nice. Oh, someone's actually put the steering rack out of this previously because they've actually put a different bolt in. They've got their steering upgrade. How good's that? Muffler delete. It's actually not too bad. Brake line delete. I don't know how his hydro is working. That's the thing, it's not. Oh, it is not. It's not. There you go. It's too much. See, what actually happens in these, the belt slap wraps around and snaps the brake line off. Like what's happened here. Yeah, look. Too much belt slapping. Yeah, that was me. That's why I need to use my not or newish tyres. Because these are. I'm surprised you broke this one off because normally it's the Paso side. Yeah, um, don't know. It was a really, it was like, it wasn't like a slap. It was a, the whole thread. It was like a retread and it just, yeah. Went off. Yeah, wiped some stuff out. She's good, she's good, eh? Super kit. Oh, hell, hell yeah. Is that stock? Is that aftermarket? It's an aftermarket, but with Oof. stock replacement. Nah, that's, that's it. Performance. It's had a muffler delete, so there's your performance. Yeah. It's actually not too bad. These, you know, these deep bushes have been severely roasted by the exhaust pointing at it. Shivy. But that's right, you have this one doing all the work. Perfect. Okay, I was just sharing. Yeah. Our face on YouTube. The perfect calculation of the street tyres and the steer tyres. Yeah with the tread on the outside being for the main turns and the baldness here does not affect. <laughs> and then the, the tread here on the inside doing the same turn and the ball outside. Well, if you saw the um, footage of it, it was just throwing sparks the entire time I was driving. That's <laughs> great. That's all you need. And then what was coming out of here? Yeah, that's pretty bad. We'll just... We have to change the LCAs because the ball joint is completely... It looks fine to me. That looks fine. <laughs> You're just like, what? So I actually have Would a it only be an issue if I jumped it, yeah? Really? No, nah, it'll just keep wearing and yeah. then eventually this will just touch the rotor. Yeah. And it'll, and it'll clear it. But it transitions terrible. Oh, okay. That's probably yeah. not good. 
Yeah, I had one break at Archie once. And I was like, oh, man, oh, no, I remember. Sparks. Now, didn't you have one break on the way home? Yeah, that was the one. Everyone's oh. like, you're shooting sparks. I'm like, oh, yeah, cool, cool. And they're like, no, you're shooting sparks all the way around. I'm like, no, I shouldn't be shooting sparks all the way around. And it was like reverse track. Yeah. You come through and like full speed at the wall and it wanted to just hit the wall and I'm like, no, Yeah, look, that's not ideal. It was like freaky, but I just, no excuses, keeps ending it. These really are built for luck though, aren't they? Look at that high yeah. clearance. If we paint this blue, we can say it's Wisefab. Yeah. yeah. Basically, Wisefab probably came to Australia and it's like, this AU, <laughs> it goes good. I do this. And I'll hit the every car. It's got the modified, uh, the rack's been ripped out of it at some stage. So huh? someone's actually put a bolt in. <laughs> so okay. that's, that's, is that good? That's good. That means you can drive on door people. Well, I have been hitting people's doors. You can see there's actually paint on the side of my tyre. There's a bunch of paint on this rim and this tyre. See, that's all paint. You can rub that off. <laughs> that's someone's paint. Oh, there, look. There you go. That's someone's clear coat. Nice. A bit of paint. <gasps> Is any of this important? It's actually from the charcoal canister. That's where it mounts right. More heat. It's not important. No. That's what I got. You got side cutters. I had raw hand. power. I had hand. You made it lighter. It's got to leave here 300 pounds lighter. Well, That's essentially. D car. Right, guys. So we've got all the bits for Luke's uh, AU. Obviously, it's a Series 1. Well, it's not obvious, but it's a Series 1. So either way, it's a Series 1. So we're going to put the Series 2 brakes in it. It's the same as, as well as the LCAs. As his ball joints are busted, um, it's just going to be easier at this shed. So that's what we're doing. Slightly worn. Slightly worn. Slightly worn. Okay? That is, slightly worn. So that is slightly worn, actually. The one, we had a car come in like two weeks ago. Damn. The wheel was falling off the car, right? And you drive it here, so it was alright. Get into it. There's That's something a spray in can lid. It's got a repair kit in the boot ready to go, spray can. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, they, they all rough there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I know you just cleaned the floor. <laughs> that, was, right. that was too interesting. Um, what are we doing? Uh, we're just going to drop the sway bar. We're doing the sway bar to lead on it. We'll go underneath and do the cam plates, get them all out as well. And the log control arms, all coming out. One camber plates. Uh, it's got no shim. We have crazy camber. We don't want that crazy camber. Put some arms in. Just because we had it. We're just going to put in the stuff we have there. Stuff we had it. You can pop a smurf. Put in Luke's car. What on earth are you doing, Luke? I'm making your floor dirty. <laughs> but I'm just Clearing making out some way. <laughs> Clearing out some of this rusty stuff. And then I'm. <laughs> Jeez. It's just rust. Alright. And then I'm doing a um, treatment, which is engine enamel. <laughs> to, to stop it from <laughs> rusty. Oh, we're gonna come in straight out of the corner. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, she painted red in there. Yeah, oh. well, it's the first can I found, so that's it like back. Red. Oh, mate, it's ready to go. It's, you red. it's red. You can go get it. Ready? You're red. <laughs> oh, oh, bleeding now. Look, it's dropping. That looks like someone died. It literally looks like someone's been stabbed. <laughs> I would nickname her Christine. <laughs> oh, oh man. <laughs> yes. But she doesn't complain. She just does her job. This isn't a Karen. No. If if it starts breaking a lot, then it'll be a Karen. Apologise for your floor. A little bit of rust. That's right. Say so none of that's dirt. It's all rust. <laughs> Camo. Camo's not in today, but tomorrow Camo will be in and he can clean up. So I continue to apprentice at AU House. Did you just clean up for us? Apprentice at AU House. Full time job. Do you just clean up rust? Pretty hard for a bender when I was putting the coilovers in the mic. Oh, There's no rust there. Inside, but That's no. good. <laughs> That's a good one. I'm done with you. This car's good. That side's a bit worse. <laughs> I'm impressed. Oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. I'm just trying to get all the rest of this down. Um, you missed the spot. <laughs> So we have the knuckles in for the mad lock. We've put the series two brakes in, waiting for some new brake pads right now. They're coming. Put Luke's space on as well. And uh, we'll get onto the rack ends. Put the spaces in there. Connect it all up and we should be sweet. Camber plates are also in there. Everything we've put in, it's, it's out of Papa Smurf. Um, just sort of there, it's all the same, just sturdy. That doesn't matter because this car's going to be going through mud and be getting dirty anyway, so perfect. So, yeah, we'll wait for the bits to come, finish it off, then get onto the rear, trim some cores down in the back, and straighten his guard and uh, probably paint the inside of this tyre well all red. Be fun. So, that's all we're going to do. You won't know until he's changing his tyre, <laughs> it's going to last. As you can see, we prepped it, so it's been going all over all the dirt. Those of you who've seen me paint stuff, I make sure I don't miss a gap. Is it worth a can of paint? Yes. yes. I'm impressed, actually. This looks kind of cool. Cannon's rocked up with a part that we need, or a tool. We'll see what his reaction is. Alright, come check out Luke's tie well. I did say a, a CA video of it somewhere. No, no, we've done a better, a better job now. Small wall painting. What do you, you want your burrito? What do you reckon? Oh God. <laughs> So we're done Luke Fink's car. We put our knuckle kit in, our camber plates, Buckwild kit is in it. And um, that's it. So now you just need to see him watch him send it at Archie. Um, yeah, thanks for watching us. Have a great week. Catch us next time.